Thailand's most famous national dish can be made raw and vegan just with a few easy switch-ups. Here's how we do it. For the noodles, we will use zucchini and we'll use a spiralizer to turn it into noodles. This is how we do it. You can also use other vegetables if you like. So you can try using cucumbers or carrots or even beetroot or radish. Okay, now it's come to the end. We'll take it out and we'll put it onto a paper towel just to, for it to soak up the liquid. Because sometimes the zucchinis can be quite moist. Today, I also have the Magimix, which is called the Magimix Spiral Expert. And if you're making these noodles for a big family, this is the perfect attachment to use. So I'm going to just use a bit more of the kitchen towel to soak up the moisture. We'll leave this here as it soaks up all the moisture to make sure that your noodles are, uh, don't get soggy. And then what we're going to do is create the Pad Thai sauce. Okay. For the sauce, we'll put in chilies and spice. We're also putting in some dried chilies as well, dried red chilies. We'll put in lime juice, coconut milk, and then we're putting in some soy sauce. Uh, since we're raw vegan, we are not using any fish sauce and to replace that, we're using miso paste instead. That will still give the nice uh, umami flavour to it. We're also putting in the Masarang Arenga sugar syrup. And what makes it uniquely Thai is the tamarind flesh from the tamarind pots. Once it's fully blended and well combined, then your Pad Thai sauce is ready and then we're going to put in the ingredients for the noodles. We'll put in the shallots, put in the garlic chives, some green sprouts, we'll add in the noodles. So you can see that it's released quite a lot of moisture. Now what we're going to do is put the Pad Thai sauce onto the zucchini noodles and the vegetables. Oh, I just realised we need to put in the tomatoes as well. So let's put in the cubed tomatoes. And now we're going to toss it all together. Your raw vegan pad thai. So, if you like this recipe, remember to follow me on Raw Chef Yin uh, on both Instagram and Facebook. And I have one more thing to show you. My book. This is my very first cookbook, Raw Vegan Delights Asian Edition, which contains 21 raw vegan recipes. Some of the recipes have never been found anywhere in the world and this is the first time that it's being published. You can get a hard copy or an ebook at rawchefyin.com book. And also remember to subscribe to Big Asia Media. See you!